Okay, what's going on this morning, bud? Well, we got the BMX homie here. Just met him, but through a connection in Guatemala City, they hooked us up with Mario Guerrero, who has his own private skate park here. So he said, let's pick up some food, head to the private park, and it's somewhere up in the mountains. So we're gonna ride in this truck for the last 200 meters or so over a dirt road. Although I kind of wonder if we'll just take the van because this thing can definitely take some roads. Good morning. Just following the homie. Seems like he's got his routine down. Pick up a whole chicken. Check. Smells good. <laughs> now we're heading to pick up some waters and refresco sodas. So I'm going to pick up that, put that on my tab. But he's super nice and we're going to get to see his local private park. He's stoked. Some British stoked. It's gonna be a good day, new country. So we're outside of the capital. The landscape has changed a fair amount. So right now is the elections in Honduras. The homie says if we do want to drink a beer, you have to find it clandestinely. Clandestinamente. <laughs> Mario said he's really careful with Corona. He has some alcohol we can clean off the top of the drinks with and stuff. That's good. And we're going to try to take the van up the, the road. Alright, coming so, for an adventure today. There used to be a better access, but they're going to build a new uh, neighborhood. So they closed it all down. It's so different out here all of a sudden, right outside of the capital city, huh? So, time to cross the river. Oh, wow. Let's see how you do. Truck in the middle is a little bit odd. Doesn't look too deep, looks like rocks. Oh my gosh. This guy's just washing his car in there. <laughs> okay, so let's just keep moving. Everything's looking good, everything's looking good. Wow, crossed a river today. <laughs> Not what I was expecting. Look at this bridge they have for pedestrian. That's so sick. Part of thing. There's a crazy hill there, and the park's right down here, so we're gonna walk.
Mario Guerrero. Here we go. So this is gonna be the sketchiest part. Oh yeah, he's giving it some power. Oh boy. faster over those bumps than I would have liked. This is a big hill. There's a bump right before it. Can you see all? Looks like I went too far in the right, so we're gonna try again. So he was saying to put it in low gear, which we don't really have. We can put it in first, I guess. Okay, so this time, we're gonna try to stay more to the left. We're gonna put it in first. Are you ready? Yeah. Everything flew out of the Ooh, Hopefully that is the last crazy bumpy uphill road that we have to do because the entire back, like the entire bookcase flew out of its cabinet. It all landed on the ground on top of Danny's bike. Luckily there's only like books and a couple of board games. It wasn't that big of a mess and we have the other cabinets all secured so nothing else fell out, just books. No banking. Couldn't do it without the support of my wife. <laughs> Little in-flight checkup, courtesy of the wife. Thanks, baby. <laughs> oh, the river crossing. Definitely gonna do whatever these do. Honestly, the only thing is that we're a little worried about her suspension right now. <laughs> and that was a bit extreme. I thought it'd be nice to bring the van over because then, you know, we got the speaker right there, we got the cat, we got everything ready. We're gonna get some ball joints mailed ahead to Costa Rica. The shipping is exorbitant, about $1,000 to ship these little pieces. We're getting lower ball joints and the struts, which is like the shock in the front. I'll feel a lot better when we get those in there. Skate park number two. I'm tired. <laughs> My first baleada. Cambia el tiempo en el reloj. Hoy mis deudas reciben perdón. Found a pretty sweet hostel roof deck here. And I think they were supposed to charge us that rate per person. <laughs> <laughs> so, five bucks for both of us for one night. And we get to chill on this roof deck and use the internet, have a shower. Since Emily found a tick earlier at the dirt shops at the, the skate park out there. Just one. So, not, not bad. This hostel is pretty sweet. It's nice. And we got here. After spending the day with a new BMX friend, we head to a hostel to shower. We met the owner and his friends, and they invited us to drink with them despite the election. We stayed up late, trading stories, and having a great time. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more Andorran adventures.